Hello, this is Ethan from Life Movement Technology. I just wanted to show you how you calibrate your 3D printer. First step is to make sure there is nothing in the way of your 3D printer. And make sure your surface of your 3D printer is kind of clean. It looks okay. Next, you're gonna wanna press on this knob. It's gonna take you to the menu. You wanna hit prepare. And then you wanna go ahead and hit auto home. This is gonna set your printer to its default. The very next thing afterwards, you want to go ahead and press on the knob here again. And you want to go down. Actually, to prepare again, I mean. After going to prepare, you're going to go all the way down again. And you're going to want to choose between ABS or PLA. We are currently using PLA. And then you're gonna preheat your PLA. And we're gonna do both. Your, um, the end or the tip of your 3D printer should go up. Up about somewhere between 205 to 225. Minimum is 205. And then your bed, your 3D printer's bed, should be going up to 60 degrees. We're about the temperatures that need to be met. And then we're gonna print from the SD card. And we're gonna do a level test. Yes, and pretty much the level test is gonna make one long line script that's not gonna really matter. And it's gonna make about five squares. And those squares should be about paper thin when it's 3D printed. They should look something like this. Yes. Yes. Now there are occasions where it won't look like that. And maybe it'll look like this. Where it looks stringy on the inside. This means that your 3D printer is either not raised enough, or it's not, or it's too high up. And on occasions, it'll look like this. This is not what you want it to look like, and that just means your 3D printer definitely needs to be raised. So right now, we are doing the... Okay, and once it's done 3D printing, it shall present it, and then that's when you can start scraping off everything. Okay, should come off pretty nice. This one's okay.
nice okay this one comes out nice and now you're ready for actually 3d printing it should be part of our next video thanks for watching my training video and help me by subscribing to my youtube channel this will help me a lot. Visit me online at www.livemobiletechnology.com. And if you like this video, click on the like button for me at the bottom of the screen.